Hey guys, my name is Rake and welcome to another episode of Better Minecraft. So, in the last episode we did build this fantasy house. Uh, I did add in some normal windows that I talked about before, but now we have absolutely no iron left whatsoever. Uh, this episode though, I know I did say I was going to build the tower here, but I kind of want to take a little break from building that tower and I want to go and try to conquer this uh, floating tower thingy. Oh, I can't remember what it was called, but there is like loads of uh, houses. It looks like a it looks like a house anyway. There's some weird blocks there. I don't know what that red one is, uh, but I know there should be some good loot in there. So I kind of want to go in there. Hopefully we survive. I've got a bunch of torches, a bunch of food, uh, a new shield. So hopefully we can survive. Oh, I should probably take some blocks actually. So I will do that. I'll grab some blocks and then we'll head over to the tower. What is this? Is this a Tasmanian devil? Oh, it is. Hey. Can I give you something? Do you want some bread? No, nope, I can't give you bread. Alright. Oh, and there is some raccoons here as well. Alright, let's head to the tower. Uh, last time we just went in it quickly and there was just monsters jumping on our heads everywhere. So, hopefully it will be a little bit easier this time. We came a bit more prepared. We do have torches. All I'm going to do really is just break every single spawner in here. Because if I'm not mistaken, the spawners in this tower, or these little dungeon things, they only have like a certain amount of spawns they can do. And then after they despawn. So let's just try to get rid of most of them so that we don't have to deal with loads of mobs at once. And hopefully we survive. Okay, actually before we do start, what is this? Red glazed terracotta. Oh, okay. That's actually kind of cool. That is a, a really nice block actually. I quite like that. Alright, so last time we went in here... Oh, there's loads of bookshelves, actually, which we can grab. We did go up somewhere, and I think it was on the ladder. So let's go up the ladder. Oh, yeah, it was, because we fell uh, all the way down here after getting hit, and that was scary. Now, how do we get up? That is the thing. I can't remember how to get up from here. Oh, there's a barrel here already. We can check. Okay, so we've got some bottles of enchanting and some iron. That's exactly what we needed, so that is really good. Hopefully, we can get up here quickly. Where did that, where did that guy go? Where'd you go? We should be able to get a decent amount of levels as well from this. Hello? Anyone up here? Oh, I hate when there's this many people. Oh, there you go. Fight. Make it easier for me. There we go. Fight, fight to the death. Ow, he had thorns. <laughs> he had fawns on his armor. I think, oh, that was it. A lot of these guys have fawns. So we do need to be careful. I thought that was a bookshelf that you can open, but it doesn't look like it. Oh, there is a hidden barrel. Bane of arthropods and some honey. Oh, a Naya vendor as well. I just saw that. Anything else up in here? Doesn't look like it. It looks like we keep having to go up, and I don't like it because I'm guessing there's going to be another spawner up here, and there's lots, so many people. Oh, you got a sword. Why have you got a potion? What was that? Ah! That was instant damage after. <laughs> yeah, I killed him. Alright, we need to be careful. Because it looks like they're going to get harder and harder. Right, on this floor, it doesn't look like there's any loot at all. Is this like a... Can I hear like a bee or something? Sounds like I can hear a bee. Oh, no, witches. Oh, really? Oh, I don't like this one. Oh, that poisoned me. Oh, that was not good. 36 seconds as well. <gasps> oh, run, 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 run. Oh, I'm getting out of here. Oh, oh that was so close. Oh, I kind of want to seal myself in now. There we go. Alright, we're going to sit down here for a little bit. We're going to heal up. And I think I might attack this level from outside and try to get rid of the spawner. Because it's going to be too hard just trying to rush in there and get the spawner. Oh, that was close. That was really close. There is a witch above us somewhere, so we do need to watch out on that one. Go away. There we go. Alright, that's one witch down. I don't think we need to go down here. Doesn't look like there's any chests actually. It's just beehives. Okay, good. Ow, they got me. Alright, let's check this chest out. Some unbreaking free protection free chainmail. Okay, that's actually really good. We've got some gold and some golden carrots and some glowstone. All right, let's take all of that. 
Look, we already got 23 iron ingots, so it's probably a lot easier to do this than mining. <laughs> uh, fire protection, that's five, and that's four, right? So I'm not going to use that, but I am going to use the chainmail armor. There we go. All right, let's get rid of our apron. And now we can climb up to the top. There's something above me over there. You can see. Um, some more food, which is good. We need food. If we don't need books, we can get those easily. <gasps> oh, my. Oh, no. I died. Oh. oh, at least we can sleep quickly. Oh, I didn't see that guy. Oh, and a creeper just exploded next to me. Oh, that was rough. All right, we need to grab a sword and some blocks. We need to run back. All right, I want to go check out over here. There was some chests. I don't know if we looted them. We haven't. A bounce too. Left, left shift to four. So in her, I did. Oh, it doesn't say exactly what it does, but that actually looks like it can be fun. So we're gonna grab that. <laughs> I wouldn't mind be able to bounce around with like some diamond boots or something. That'd be really cool. All right, now we got the. I'm not gonna clear that side just yet. I want to clear all the bottom parts first. So we've got this side now. Oh, I thought that was a statue for a second. <laughs> that guy was just standing there on the. On the thing. All right, hello, Mister. You're just a normal zombie. That's easy to deal with. There we go. Okay, what is this then? Just a little. Oh, this is the the like village thing or the little buildings that are just floating. Oh, there's a bed up here. Actually, I might set my spawn point up here. There we go. Oh yeah, there you go. Respawn point set. Oh wow, even more bread. I'm going to take all of this bread actually because we're going to need it later on. That is a uh, quite a lot of enchants on a uh, chainmail helmet. Alright, we're going to have to say goodbye to the... Actually, I'm going to get the other one. But yeah, we have to say goodbye to the helmet. Uh, well, not the helmet, actually. The farmer's hat. We're going to need one of these instead. That one's got projectile protection free. Yeah, I think that one's better. So we're going to take this quickly. Put that on our head. There we go. So now we're all chain milled out. Oh, actually, we've got iron on the bottom. But we have got a bunch of uh, better armor now. So hopefully we can survive a little bit longer. There's so many emeralds up here. Look at that. We've got 33 emeralds. Uh, that's uh, 5%. What does this one do? 5 as well. So I'm breaking through protection free. Alright, I'm going to keep the one I got. I've got loads of food as well. I kind of want to take all the food I can. Why are there phantoms up here? What is going on up there? Alright, it's night time. I'm going to go back to these beds down here and actually sleep the night because I don't want to fight all of those at night time. I have no idea what's happening. I think we might die on this one, guys. <laughs> I have no idea what is up there. Something's shooting me, but I can't see what it is. Oh my god, look at me. Oh, that's a lot up there. Alright, I think I know how I can do this. The spawner's like in the middle somewhere, so let's try to break it. Oh, we got it perfectly, alright. So that's gone. We'll have to deal with the skeletons after though. Alright, now we just need to kill some of these guys. Alright, there's one gone. One phantom. Oh, regrets were made. I can't get back down. Oh. I'm trying to spot where the spawner is. I can't find it. If I can get rid of their spawner, the skeletons, then we can actually do this. Our shield has only got 26 HP left as well, so this isn't too good. Round two. Oh, that guy has like punch. Punch like 60,000 or something. Where are... I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. They're not following me either, so like... Oh, they're on the, on the phantoms. Oh, that's how I can't... That's why I can't see him. Alright, we need to get rid of... Where did that guy come from? Oh, he must have fallen through the hole. Let me do that then. There we go. Alright, this is tough, guys. Hopefully there's a lot of loot. Alright, let's just grab everything. Okay, we can't. There we go. Protection free. I uh, don't want to get rid of. Let's get rid of that. We've got a stack of thingies already. Oh, there's a saddle arch. I want that. And I'm going to grab the disc. Alright, there we go. Now that these guys done. I'm not doing this anymore. There's no point. Oh, that was rough. That was really, really rough. 
But there is another way up as well, I noticed. So over here, I think. I think it's on this one, yeah. Alright, so we have to go up here still. Hopefully we can do this one. If I had a bow, it would be a lot easier. I don't think I have one, no. We've got arrows, but we can't make one. Alright, I'm going to drop all of this, and I'm going to do the same tactic of just rushing in there and trying to loot the chest. Let's go. What oh, on you? <gasps> oh, this always scares me. Why can't I open it? Why can't I open it? Oh, my game's frozen. Uh, this isn't too good. I'm going to have to restart my game. Okay, I'm back. Oh, this isn't good though. Oh, what's that? Hang on. Uh, let's just grab all of this first. Uh, we don't want that. We don't want uh, that, I guess. Golden apple, we do want. Iron boots, we don't want. Mining system explorer map. Hmm. Alright, let's take that and some food. Can I eat that quickly? Yes, I can. Let's eat that taffy. There we go. And grab our sign balls back. Alright. Oh my goodness, so many people above me. I think we've got everything. Pretty sure that's everything, yeah. Alright, well let's head back down. Let's head home quickly. I'll go check out all of the loot we've got. Okay, we have actually made it back safely. Uh, we did get attacked by some monsters uh, coming out because it was night time. But this is what we got. So we got some coal, a bunch of gold. We got a stack and 11 gold, a stack and 3 iron. We got 9 diamonds, which is really good. And a treasure map, actually. We need to check that out. We got an enchanted bounce 2 book. And a ether dragon egg. Oh, okay. I don't know how you tame these. I'd have to look it up or how you hatch them. I think you can. Uh, oh, we got all of these as well. Let's chuck all of these out. 36 bottles of enchanting. There we go. Spam it. 21 levels. Nice. If we didn't die, we'd probably have over 30 levels right now. But yeah, we got 47 diamonds we did as well. Some honey. It's better than... Oh, honey's actually quite good uh, as a food uh, source. So probably going to use that. Now, we did get some armor as well. I think next, though, I know there's... Uh, well, I want to check the treasure map out. And there is something purple over there. Oh, I think it's a plant. I was looking at my mini map. And, yeah. So, I think we're going to actually check out this map quickly. Let's see. Uh, okay. Well, there's no X marks the spot. <laughs> Mining system explorer map. Oh, I guess it's for caves, maybe? I have no idea. Actually, before we head out again, though, I am going to craft myself a bow, because right now, that was, like, too hard. If we had a bow, it would have been a lot easier, so let's craft one of those quickly. There we go, and free string. All right, there we go. We've got a bow. I kind of want to head out again to see if we can find anything, uh, see if there's any, like, different monuments or something like that we can find. I think it would be really fun. I'm enjoying, like, exploring these things. That one was quite hard, though. Not going to lie, especially when we got to the top. All right, guys, I just remembered... There is this massive windmill thing with those deadly zombie villager things. Yeah, these guys do a lot of damage, so I'm hoping that that means uh, there's going to be some good loot. Okay, yeah, I'm here now. There is some illagers or pillagers, whatever you want to call them, right around here. So I need to watch out. I don't want to run into one of those zombie guys right now. What is that? Is that just... Yeah, what is that over there? That looks weird. Okay, no, it's just a tree. <laughs> All right, um, how, do we... how are we going to go about this? All I know is that if we do need wheat, there is loads over here. I think we're just going to just rush it. And I might just pillar up to the top. Because these pillagers are going to be annoying. I don't know how I'm going to... I didn't mean to eat my golden apple. I thought I was eating... Oh, I thought I was eating my my bread. Alright, um, how are we going to go about this? Because these guys are going to be a pain. Why are they all coming in? Oh, what is happening? I'm getting swarmed. There's so many over there. Oh my. Oh, my game just froze. Alright, luckily they didn't do any damage. There's some, we got some beer. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Uh, it seems like it makes you weak though, but it does haste two, speed two. Okay, so if we like in trouble, we can actually drink it and run away. I'm so scared something's going to land on my head. There's another barrel right here. Okay. Wow. All right, yeah, I think the way to get stuff in this game is just to loot around. Let me put those on, though. And those. There we go. And I'm breaking chest plate. Oh, okay. It says, oh, when you shift, it's, it, it compares it to the one that you have. 
Okay, well, I'm going to wear that because it says it's got more protection. Gonna run around, torch everything up. Yeah, you keep shooting at me. That's okay. All right, there we go. That has all been torched up now. There we go, and that guy's gone as well. Terminator? What? Oh, termination. <laughs> what is this? Oh, there's a... Oh. Oh, I shouldn't have done that! Oh, goodness. Okay. Looks like I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> Oh, that's crazy. Oh, look at all these hoppers, though. I'll take that. And we've got some cauldrons. There's some more TNT. I always forget that that's TNT. Oh, that was scary. That was actually really scary. Oh, it looks like I lost all the loot by doing that, though. Oh, silly me. <laughs> that raid is scary. Oh, actually, I found some. Okay, I'll take that diamond sword. It's better than my one. All right, that is actually really cool. So this is what we got pretty much. So we got like almost three stacks of iron just from those two areas. <laughs> two stacks of emeralds, uh, a bunch of gold. We did have these already, but that, I think we found those last time in uh, like the underground part down here, like the dungeon. Uh, we also got a dragon egg. So we need to find how this works. So I'm going to look it up quickly on, uh, on the internet and I'll get back to you guys once I've actually figured it out. Okay, guys, so... Uh, I've looked it up and I think I know how to do it now. Uh, what we need to do is go like above like Y level 100 and something. And we need a fish as well to actually feed it to tame it. So I'm going to have to do a little bit of fishing to get some fish. Uh, actually we could actually just go in there and just uh, whack them with our sword. But I want to see what fishing's like in this mod pack. So maybe you might get some cool loot. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, well guys, I was getting to the top of this right here. Uh, to uh, Not loot, sorry. To actually place the dragon egg which I just realized I don't even have <laughs> oh I gotta go all the way back down to our house and go get the dragon egg I thought I had it on me but I did find this up here that I obviously didn't loot before I'm guessing it's because I just rushed up here to attack all these guys so yeah um, I need to go to 175 which uh, this is the perfect area well just above 170 I need to go so I thought I'd go up to the top of this hill or not hill this building but now I have to go all the way back down to there, or where my stuff is just over there, to get the dragon egg that I forgot. Alright, well, I'll see you guys <laughs> once I'm back up here, but with the dragon egg. And we have made it. Okay, so, if I'm not mistaken, you just place that down. And I think you just have to wait a little bit. I'm going to torch it up up here so nothing else spawns. But I think that's pretty much all you have to do. And now we just have to wait. So I'm just going to AFK here for a little bit. I'll probably like have a time lapse it'll sink. But I'm hoping that we do get sank to spawn reasonably quick. Uh, maybe before night time. I do have a bed on me so we're okay with that. Place that down. There we go. Yeah, so all I have to do now is just wait. And then I'm meant to feed it fish. So I did fish a little bit. I've got a bunch of fish here. There we go. Alright, now we just wait and uh, hope that it spawned. Oh, the dragon spawn. Come here. Hey, did I tame it? Uh, I don't know if I tamed it. I don't know how you know. <laughs> Growing time, zero seconds. Alright, let me block all of this off quickly. So I don't want it to run away. Get rid of this as well. There we go. Let's block all of these exits off. If it jumps off the edge, that'd be terrible. No, no, don't go towards the edge, please. Okay. There we go. One there, and some more blocks here. Alright. Good. Okay, I'm just going to wait for it to actually grow up now. See, it looks like it's nowhere near ready. Uh, growing time. Okay, uh, give you another fish. I think it's tamed. It, I did get the love hearts, so I'm guessing it is tamed. Alright guys, it looks like my dragon is fully grown because I did manage to put a saddle on it, but I haven't jumped on it yet, I was waiting to do that on camera. So hopefully it's not complicated. Oh wow, that is a lot of hearts. Uh, can you attack stuff? Oh, okay, you're spinning around really quickly. Look at that, Wee! <laughs> Alright, can we fly? Oh, that's not, don't press shift. Oh, okay, okay, there we go, so we're flying. Oh, that is actually kind of cool. This is so cool. Oh, it's very laggy for me right now because I just uh, joined the game again. So I had to restart it. But this is so cool. 
Oh, that is actually really... Uh, let me just turn up my FOV quickly, like, to maximum. Oh, that looks so cool. That is really, really cool. Uh, don't pay attention to the back of my unfinished house. But this is actually really good because we'll be able to travel a lot more and find some more stuff. Like, uh, look at this jungle over here. Um, is there any... I saw some beehives and all that. So we could just do, use this to travel and we could even cheat and go on the top of these towers here, like uh, the one we just done, and just go loot the chest straight away. Oh, that is really, really cool. All right, let's let's uh, let's go home quickly and bring this dragon to our new home. We're going to need a new name for our dragon as well. So make sure to leave a name in the comment section below. And that's pretty much going to be it. Though. How do I land? Am I landed? Okay, so you just fly to the ground. And then if you press space, you go up in the, in the sky. Okay. Uh, you guys could maybe find a name beginning with a P because it kind of looks like a P on its back. So that could be kind of something we could use for a name. But anyway, apart from that, guys... Oh, there's a lot of lag. <laughs> but no, anyway, apart from that, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.